Hello guys, welcome to Pentestress Club. Today we are going to discuss about Brutal Toolkit. So what is Brutal Toolkit? So Brutal is an extremely useful for executing scripts on the target machines without the need of human to keyboard interactions. When you insert the device, it will be detected as a keyboard on using the microprocessors on onboard. Flash memory storage, you can send a very fast set of keystrokes to the target machines and completely compromise it regardless of an auto run. I have used it in my security testings to run a recon or enumeration scripts that execute a reverse shells, exploits local DLL and hijacking, privilege escalations and vulnerabilities and get all passwords. Now develop a new tool called is it brutal. So what is brutal? Brutal is a toolkit that quickly creates a various payloads and power cells attacks various attacks and launch a listeners for human interface on device. So we can do a prank, we can do a sending a systems uh, uh, alert messages and uh, shutdowning messages and we can do many things. Like uh, we see some things uh, uh, in movies like do you want to like a Mr. Robot hacking scenes with uh, Angelia Moss and uh, plug the USB into the computers and get a credential information. You can choose a payload in a brutal also. It's available here. So ready to go. So generate uh, the goal is generate various payloads and partial attacks without uh, coding. To help a uh, breaking computer very fast and, uh, fast and easy, easier way. The payloads compatibility target Windows machines is only. So we required uh, something new here. So let's come to the here. So we copy this and come to the Linux machine, open the terminal. So it will take some time to open. Yes. Now paste the repository. And enter. So it will clone the repository. So it's already clone. So return list. So there is no requirement. Chmlx. So here we can see. So what we can do here? Meter printer reverse TCP and injections using PowerShell download and execute a backdoor attacks also so we can create one backdoor applications either pdf word document or anything xyz and we can send it get a credentials information with the uh, man in the middle attacks and send to a gmail also and retrieve a password storing in the local computers by gmail payload prank with attacker uh, computers so we can do a fun with the opponent computers also uh, then Payload manager with Windows, attacking Windows at your own risk. Uh, help on tutorial. So let's try with the uh, zero one. Set L host. So L host. We are going to use our IP address. I have config so 162.168.1.6 so we put our IP address it's not 
testing elbowed four four three. So it's done. It's creating a payload. So we can see a Windows shell bind TCP, Windows reverse shell TCP, Windows meter printer reset TCP, uh, reverse TCP DNS, reverse HTTP, reverse Windows meter printer reverse HTTPS. Okay. Then done. So now the copy is generated. Meter printer injections PowerShell into in your ID. Uh, do you want to exit? No. So this is what a uh, very simple, easy way to create a payload. Number two, we go for a download and execute the payloads. So wait, we are starting the Apache servers. You can upload your backdoor into your server. So enter the password. Name of your backdoor. Backdoor is TikTok. TikTok. So locate your file. So where is our file? So we see here a bridger. Output. So this is our uh, output file. Chrome dot kali forward slash kali. Chrome forward slash kali. Stash, Twitter, stash, output, forward slash, then we go here, So this is our payload link. Success payload is created. That's it. So we can send it to this back door to some other persons. That's it. No. Then get a credential information with the man in the middle attack. So number three. Uh, so note input your email. So I will input my email address. Input your password. Go here. File receive send to so I am sending to here something success. So we have successfully created a payload. So it's very simple thing how we are creating. Retrieve a lot of passwords so we can see. Input your email, the password, receive a send. No, so we can uh, hack while using our email address and password also their uh, opponent what they stored in the uh, passwords in the phone and everything. So payload prank, so we can see now payload prank. So payload prank is a single payload hello world. Wait, you can edit the thing. So output hello world dot into into your HID. Mm, so you need to send it this hello world dot INO to your client. So it will be given a prank to the their persons. 
and don't fuck it up too so we need to send this uh, don't fuck it up so this is an prank things okay we need to send this uh, payload files to the targeted mission Uh, three I will learn to lock my computer so we need to send this type of payloads to the client and write a message to a notepad it's almost generating all payloads and five screen rotation prank success so once we send this payload so now we are going to rotate the screen so it will be rotate the screen so it will be some prank things number six auto shutdown prank auto shutdown prank will become a, at the uh, control shift i also uh, uh, otherwise they will make with the system misconfiguration errors play youtube recrawl we can see this so if you can giving this type of payloads it will be played for you to run some other things and uh, auto facebook post crashing windows with the power prompt and uh, we go for back i will see these things so payload is uh, manage uh, windows we see six so we can add admin user add uh, user to enable rdp add users to enable telnet add you uh, users and enable RDP plus telnet add user to enable with the PS remoting bypass admin login screen also so we go for back we see everything Seven. so while we coming for attacking windows so windows uh, crash a windows forever one so one so it's generated in one uh, I one file you can send it to your targeted persons it will crash the total his windows laptop only so do it your own risk okay and delete all drives you can see this uh, this whom you want to delete some unnecessary data so it will delete uh, it will delete all the necessary things from here and delete all registry delete system drive so uh, this payload will generate a some delete files so it will delete all the system drives a, uh, c d e f and etc z everything everything whatever you have number five uh, goodbye to windows so we can we can say goodbye to windows on the system uh, display and uh, no and rename all files to txt so whatever you are uh, uh, you have in windows your pc on windows pc so you can re rename that uh, files names with the txt so that's it so the systems is crashed totally so thank you for watching guys it's have a nice day we'll get it another video